going on ladies and gentlemen my name is Twigger and I have another League of Legends game for you playing as Talon in the mid lane and we basically we've got a uh, five man team here just uh, having some fun with some friends but a lot of the names you would probably find familiar mods from my channel friends that have been in other games and so on and so forth but um, we've got a blitzcrank on each side here so it looks like we're going really ham to the party right now um, because we want to get the invade on. And there could be like a counter invade. I don't know when. I don't know where people are invading or who's invading what, but we're gonna try to make something happen. I don't know where they might have gone around um, through our tri brush to invade. And to be honest, that's like that's even if they. Oh 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 oh! Come on, come on! No. And just like that, it's over. It's all done. No more invades. <laughs> so we're currently on this game. Uh, we have an Urgot as the ADC. Which I haven't seen an Urgot in quite some time, but I'm excited to see it. Um, we've got uh, Blitzcrank, of course, both in the bot lane as the support versus Misfortune Urgot. In the mid lane, Cassiopeia versus my Talon. Um, I'm not an overly fantastic Talon. I've never really considered myself to be very good at him, but I've been playing him a lot recently on my other account uh, because I figured that I wanted to record a video with him at some point, um, but I definitely needed to practice on him, so that is the idea. Oh, already getting hit by that, which is super duper awesome. Um... So I, I like this matchup, like Talon versus Cassiopeia, I think is not going to be too bad for me. Um, it's all going to be really dependent on how much poke she gets off on me prior to me getting my abilities to go kind of all in on her face. See, like doing that, that missing that poke, that's huge because now I can walk up and I do that. Oh God, but then she hits me again. So yeah, Cassiopeia being one of those champions who has a very annoying amount of poke. Um, and it's going to be even worse when she gets her E. Because once she gets her E, it's just it's just a nightmare, right? Like you end up taking so much damage just because you're constantly trying to run away from her while still trying to provide some damage. It's just never a fun thing to do. But luckily, I do have my Corruptor's Potions, which um, will definitely sustain me for a bit. There we go. Get a little bit of... Oh, God. But every single time I try to get some stuff done, she ends up just, uh, you know... A poke in the back, but uh, minions, uh, minions, Ooh, auto attack. Okay, so we've gotten actually quite a bit of damage off on her. That's at least something, right? Oh jeez. Oh man. Okay, so her her ignite is now down, but here comes my Quinn. Get her! Get her! Yes! Yes! <laughs> oh my god, that was scary. That was so scary. But there we go! Oh, perfect. I actually thought that I was gonna die there. She turned on me so aggressively, I was like, oh no! But luckily was not enough. So, Quinn picking up first blood. I got an assist on that one, which is pretty great. Um, I'm thinking I'm gonna be going for a, um, a Hex Drinker pretty early. Um, Hex Trigger, I actually find, is just such a good item to have on AD Assassins if you're going up against an AP who you know is going to poke you. Um, because it just provides an extra little bit of shielding. Um, it gives you a little bit of extra damage. Gives you the magic resistance that you need um, to kind of survive the poke that's going to be coming out so that we, you hopefully don't die to it. Um, and since we got kind of the first blood, she's going to be a little bit behind. So um, normally getting the Hex Trinker first, I don't like as much because I would much rather get into like my really aggressive Assassin-like items. Um, like the Dirk and Warhammer and all those things to go into my Ghost Blade, but I'm kind of fine since she got first blood and she's going to be a little bit behind in CS. She's going to be a little bit less strong than she would like, so I feel like me being a little bit less strong going for the parts of the Hex Drinker first, um, it's not going to hinder me too much. But uh, since her Ignite is down, my Ignite is down as well, but my Flash is down, and I don't think that she flashed, so I might have to take that into consideration because I kind of want to go a little bit aggressive. But not if it's going to possibly kill me, you know? Okay. So she's just doing her thing. I might have to uh, farm under turret here. Which I'm kind of okay with. I think once I now have... Like, since I now have the longsword, um, I think I can actually take down the... Ah, uh... oh, bummer. I think I can take down the range minions. Oh my god, that is so much more damage than I initially expected. Okay. I I got gotcha. you. 
I got gotcha. you. You're not, you're not overly happy about this. I get it. Oh my god, that actually, that hurt so bad. Oh, 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 can we get her? Can we get her? Ah, oh, damn it, I was just out of reach. That sucks. I almost had enough to get my E off. Like, I was almost in range. And if I got my E off, then I was definitely going to be able to get my W off, which would have slowed her down. And then the Quinn could have caught up and we probably would have secured ourselves a kill. So, the only reason I'm going super ham here is because she has no mana. Right? So, since she has no mana, I'm just going to go all out on her. This is not a point of me not doing that, right? Okay. I've got enough mana to get my ulti off. Do I want to dive? Okay, I just saw... Yeah, okay. Zack is right there. So I don't want to be... I don't want to be too aggressive. And now the Blitzcrank coming down too? What do you guys want from me? Why are you all here? Is this a party in the mid lane? Um, okay. Oh, God! Ah! Oh, okay. Okay, nope. No, no, it doesn't collapse back in. It was so close. Damn it. Let's flash down. That was so damn close to picking up a kill on the backside of that one. Damn it, that's annoying. So they put the pink ward in there. They actually found out where I was because the Zack placed it. I thought I was going to try to be sneaky and get around to her. But then the Blitzcrank being, I don't know why the Blitzcrank was there. It was there for such a long period of time. And now that's actually really unfortunate for me. I got my extra trigger, which is a good thing, but now I'm going to miss this big wave of minions. She's going to be able to go back. She's level 6 now, so she's going to have her ultimate available, which is not going to be good for me. Um, this is just kind of not the position that I wanted to be in. I would much rather have had that kill go back and buy, and she would have been a bit further behind than this. But um, I guess, like, hopefully we'll get a gank pretty soon. But it looks like, like Blitzcrank is just roaming like crazy. It's, oh no, it, wow, yeah, it's a top Blitzcrank. I didn't realize that. That explains why he might have been mid. I thought it was support, but no, it's support Kale. Support Kale. Okay. So once again, trying to avoid as much damage as possible. Um, I definitely want to take out this pink ward though, because I know it's sitting here. And that at least didn't get them a lot of uh, vision. There we go. Okay. So that thing's dead. Oh! Avoided. Um, I definitely don't think that we can, uh, make a play here. I don't know where the Blitzcrank is, though. Like, once again, I have no idea where Blitz is. Which, um, should always be a little bit of a sign that you shouldn't be too aggressive. Oh, God. What the hell? What are you doing here? You having a good time, Zach? Yeah? That's good. Okay, so I still don't know where the Blitzcrank is. Like, yeah, it's great that I saw the, uh, the Zack. Ah! Ah! Got her! Yes! Woo! Okay, so I think I actually flashed her ulti there. I think. I'm gonna have to rewatch that, but I'm fairly certain that I flashed the ulti. Oh, God! Uh-oh. Yeah! Oh, God! What was that? I saw a red mark. Oh, my God. Okay, that's the Blitzcrank. <laughs> okay. Now I'm running away. Okay. So, I'm actually... So, I'm maxing my rake first uh, because it's just, I find, the best source of damage for Talon. You want that on the lowest cooldown possible. Um, I'm going to pick this up, and then I guess I'm going to, yeah, go back to lane. Um, so, yeah, you want to have the uh, the biggest cooldown, lowest cooldown possible on that rake because it does a lot of damage. It also slows the enemy by 35%, and it activates your passive because you do 10% more damage with your basic attacks to any target that's slowed. So, you always, when you're starting your combo off, use your E, then use your W to slow the target, and then knock out your all your abilities to do more damage. But, um... I'm maxing my E next because it's the uh, the amplifying of damage for me. Um, which just the, the higher you can get that amplified damage, the better. Um, I feel like I'm going to miss a couple minions here. Probably not going to get this one. Oh, I am. Stop throwing things at my face. So, yeah, this is just what I have to deal with. My hex trigger is now going to be up in just a couple seconds. So, feeling pretty good about that. I know that my ultimate is on a lower cooldown than hers. So I'm probably going to want to... 
Oh, baby. Oh, baby. That was some kind of damage. Um, so it's actually interesting, but the way that you should play when you have the Dirk, um, it, it's a weird mechanic, but you, it actually does make a difference. Um, if you choose to use it. Uh, but once you kill a minion, you get this Dirk's ability, which will deal an additional, I think, 15 damage on your next attack. So it's important to try to, like, kill an enemy and then engage on the uh, the enemy champion because you'll just get the... Don't get me wrong, it's 15 damage. It's not the biggest thing in the world, but sometimes, you know, I've seen people get away with 15 HP, and that would have stopped it. So now I've killed a minion. If I kill one of these guys, I might want to go in. Now oh, you know what, actually. She's probably getting to the point where she might have her ultimate back up again, and that scares me. Because if I don't play it right, I get ultied, and then I'm probably going to die. Okay. Trying to avoid as much of this poison as possible. Ha <laughs> ha! You missed! <laughs> Yay! So I think at that point for Cassiopeia, it was basically just you might as well throw out your ultimate and hope that you hit me. Because she was pretty much dead one way or the other. Uh, my ignite is going to be up in 30 seconds. So I think when she comes back into lane, I'm going to be aggressive again. Um, but I don't actually know where the Blitzcrank is or where the Zack is. Where is Zachary? Okay, I'm probably just going to clear out this wave and then I'm going to go... Oh, there's the Zack. Hey! How's it going? So he is, uh, he's going to be building the uh, Cinder Hulk enchantment, which makes sense. Fairly standard on Zack, what he's planning on doing. I have seen Runic Echo Zack, though, and it's actually pretty damn good. But I'm kind of happy that he's going more for the tankier route. It's it's more normal, and it's, it's I find it, it's generally better on Zack, in my personal opinion. But it looks like the Blitzcrank is in the mid lane. So I think that means that Cassiopeia is going to be going to the top side. Uh, yeah, they are switching. Jeez. I don't know how I feel about that. I don't think I'm going to do very well against a Blitz. I don't know. 3-1-1. One, and one. He's 3-1-1. One, and one. So at least it's a more even lane. So um, maybe our Rumble can get a little bit of... Like a little bit more farm than what he's... Ah! Oh god. Okay. There's his Flash. That's, that's something. Um... God, I don't know what to do. Okay, well, there's the Zack. Now I know exactly what I want to do. I want to run. Unless I can use my ulti to get into him. Oh, never mind. God, I don't want to be here. Don't want to be here. Don't see me! You saw nothing. Yes, you saw nothing. Okay, so I've got one more sack of my Corruptor Potion. I'm probably just going to use that. Um, Zack is definitely nearby, but it looks like I can do decently against this Blitzcrank. Oh, jeez. Ow. Um, okay. I don't really want to be. Like, I know that I would die if I get hooked. If I get hooked, I'm going to get full comboed by the Blitzcrank. And then I'm going to get screwed. Oh, that's what I wanted. That is exactly what I wanted. Woohoo! <laughs> okay. Can't believe that actually panned out, but just flashing in on him, getting my, uh, my amplified damage down, getting my ultimate off, and that ended up being enough to take him down. So... I think we're going to do okay if the Blitzcrank decides to stay here. Okay. So there we go. Blue buff for me. Always love it as a mid laner. And now I'm probably going to go B because I've got 1100 gold. Um, which I can now finish off my Ghost Blade. So that's one of my major damage items that I've now completed. My Pink Ward is still alive, surprisingly. Don't know how the hell that works. Um, I did activate my Hex Drinker, um, during that first initial engage with Blitzcrank, so gotta be a little bit worried about that, but now I know that Blitzcrank doesn't have his, I don't believe his Ignite or his Flash available, just like me when we were fighting in that, so I could have the advantage on him, but you always have to be careful though, because Blitzcrank's ultimate is on like, a, what, 20 second cooldown or something like that? Like, it's not very long. Okay. It looks like he's just kind of clearing the wave. I don't mind that. Um, our team is kind of grouping up here. Uh, there is a pink ward there, though. So I want to take that out. But that also could just be horrific bait. Ah, it was! Yeah, you think you're going to fool us like that? Come on! Oh, God. Okay, that was incredibly painful. 
That was like the majority of my HP just went down from that one. Okay, so it looks like we got a Kale coming up here as well. What is with everybody and joining up here? Okay, come on. You guys to Oh, no. Come on. Stay, 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 stay. Come on. Oh, come on. Come on. No! Where did you all go? No! I tried everything to get up here. Bastards. I really wanted that. That would have been really nice for me. Okay, so what do we do next? We probably should get our boots, and now I'm thinking we should probably go for the Merc Treads, because we are taking a lot of magic damage with the basically AP Blitzcrank. We've got the Cassiopeia as well, Zack, and Kale. So I'm thinking <laughs> right now, my most important attribute is going to be magic resistance, along with my assassination stats. Um, because I just don't want to die from burst magic damage or just the sustained magic damage coming out of somebody like the Cassiopeia. But, um, so far I think we're doing okay. Oh man, the Blitzcrank is low, though. Twigger wants a kill, though. Uh. But I gotta focus on the farm, though. Okay, I hope that he uses his hook to get this cannon creep. That's... That's the hope here. Come on. There you go. Okay, so he used his hook. Would I have enough damage if I went in... Oh god. Oh, this is anti-good. Okay, well, we got him, though. So traded. I think I could have played that a hell of a lot better. Um, at least I got the experience for the kill, and Blitzcrank didn't. That's something. But they got they got an assist for it, which is definitely more in their favor. The duel between Quinn and Zack. Kind of coming out pretty even. But at least we're going to get a pink forward from that as well. But they did get an assist, so once again, it's more in their favor. But... Maybe if I activated my Ghost Blade, maybe that would have sped me up enough. I didn't actually get... I noticed that my E was not on cooldown. I thought I had activated it on the Blitzcrank when I got my combo off, but I didn't. So I might have actually... It would have probably helped if I got that on him first to get the Amplified Damage and then try to focus on the, uh, the Zac. Because then at least I might have had a little bit more time after my ultimate. I wouldn't have had to activate it immediately. But once again, it's all this kind of like... Woulda, coulda, shoulda, but I didn't. I now know that the Blitzcrank doesn't have his Ignite. Neither do I. We're both gonna have our Flash up in about 40 seconds. But uh, so far, the team seems to be doing pretty decently. I'm 5, 2, and 1. 16 to 8, the current scoreline. Blitzcrank is now in the bottom lane. So I'm gonna use this opportunity to try to push this in. Eh. 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 Got it. Okay. Come here, turret! Um, I don't think I'm actually going to be able to kill this, but I think I can do a lot of damage to it. Actually, oh god. Oh, what? <laughs> what was that? Did anybody see what that Zack looked like when he was flying towards me? <laughs> he did make it, though, so good on him. Um, I think I'm just going to push this thing up. I know. I know. I know. You don't like me. I don't like you. Wait, I get it. Okay, I don't know where the Blitzcrank is. But he doesn't have his passive. Ho ho ho! Got him! Ah! No! I didn't have enough. Shit! No! Quinn! No! Come on, turret! Do way more than that! Oh, man. Okay, so... Um, yeah, looks like, sadly, the Quinn died uh, to the flash pull of the Blitzcrank. I had to use my flash as well, so the one good thing about both of us using our flash around the same time is that I'm gonna know the general timeline of Blitz's flash, um, which is a good thing, but I feel like I should be trying to go top, um, simply because I think the Rumble's getting pushed in a little bit, and I can deal with the cast. Like, she is... She is nothing to me, and I shall break her. Um, Rumble's got his Abyssal Scepter, though, so he should be dealing with the damage fairly well. Um, I really like that pickup. It's a solid kind of build if you're going to be going up against somebody like a Cassiopeia, who you didn't expect to go up against. You were going up against a Blitzcrank, which I think is even more weird than a Cassiopeia, but what can you do? Kale's currently in my lane pushing, which I'm not a big fan of, but I have a lot of support coming.
Yeah, that's exactly. That's the good stuff. So she, yeah, she pushed my uh, my lane in, but didn't really accomplish much. Oh jeez. Okay, this is. Uh, I don't think the Urgot's gonna get out of that one. I think I should probably just push. Right? It doesn't make much sense for me to go down there if I know I'm not gonna get a kill. But it does make sense to come over here to try to get a turret if they're gonna be doing the dragon. That's my understanding. That's that's my lay of the land. Okay, the dragon is now dead. I should not be staying. Because they're already gonna be heading up here. So let's mosey our way into the jungle. Maybe plant a ward, try to see if anybody's going to be coming up here. Is there a blue buff available? It is not. That is unfortunate because that means they're going to push my mid lane. And I don't want them to push my mid lane. No! Don't touch it! Stop it! Stop! No! No! Don't! Don't! No! Damn it! Oh, hello. Meet my team. Got him. Oh, God. Ah! Jump. No, 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 no. Ignite is too much. Damn it. I tried everything. <laughs> I'm just slowly but surely dying, but I don't have any damn lifesteal. But we did end up taking down two. So, yeah, I died, but we got the Blitzcrank and the Zack. I think we got a shutdown from the Blitzcrank, so... All in all, not too bad, but it looks like our Blitzcrank might be going down. No. Oh, now. Swap. Don't swap her into the Blitz. What? Okay. Um, I definitely don't agree with that swap. <laughs> kind of got her right in range of that. Okay, so that ends up completely not being worth it. Um, because we lost, what, four? Three members total to their two. And they got a lot of assists. Oh, unless Quinn can even it up. And she does. Oh, God. I'm, I'm coming. I'm coming, girl. I'm coming. Coming. Come on. Hang in there. Okay. Oh. Oh, now. now. Oh, my God. He just got blown up. Okay, so that was actually not too bad. We ended up trading a bunch of kills. Um, we got another two, sorry, three from that because Quinn ended up trading with the, uh, sorry, killing the Cassiopeia. So all in all, I think total in that fight, we didn't come out too badly. But um, of course you, oh no! Don't do it. Oh my God. This Blitzcrank damage though. Okay. Can we? Eh. Now run! <laughs> no part of me wants to hang with that Blitzcrank anymore. Man, so he does. He's going for Magius, and he's already got 12 stacks on it. That is... That is slowly but surely becoming a very scary Blitzcrank. Um, sadly, our Blitzcrank is, in fact, a... Actually, he's not even support. We have, like, two AP Blitzcranks. <laughs> I'm not sure I understand this. How did this all happen? How did this all come to be? Okay, so Zack doesn't have his ulti. I'm 8, 4, and 4. The Blitzcrank is 10, 4, and 3. Um, we're still doing pretty well, though. 23 to 19, the total kill score. Um, there is a warden. Oh, no. Come on. Damn it. Okay. I re Oh, God! Okay, leave me be. Please, leave me be. I really was hoping that the, uh, the Kale wasn't going to be there. Because if the Kale wasn't there, I would have flashed over the wall and jumped onto the, um... The misfortune. Guaranteed I would have done that. Because I definitely have enough burst damage. Oh my god. That was such a mistake on my part. I don't know why I was so close. Um, okay. I guess, well, we got the Kale ulti. And I think we got the flash from the Zack as well. I'll take it. Oh, jeez. And now we return with a hook of our own. Oh god. Oh, okay. Oh god. Okay. That's a lot of people dead. Um, currently a two for two, it seems. Oh god. Got him. Okay, actually, it was Rumble who picked that up, which is actually better. To be honest, I don't really want a lot more kills right now because I'm already pretty damn strong. 
But I want my team to start doing a lot of damage. Oh my god, that was close. You wanna do this, buddy? Oh god! Finish it off! Yes! Nicely done! Beautiful! We're gone! Sorry about that! I'm leaving! Okay! Whoo! Oh, it looks like Rumble might have been grabbed. Oh, he did get grabbed. Okay. So, I'm just gonna do the Gromp. I might be able to... No, I'm probably not gonna do anything else, actually. Okay, so that was a really good fight. We're now 10, 4, and 6. But, uh, Blitzcrank 12, 4, and 4. My goodness. And he's got 22 stacks. If anybody gets hooked by that guy, they're pretty much dead. Oh, man. How the hell are we gonna deal with that? So, I'm going for my, uh, my Black Cleaver next. I really like Black Cleaver on Talon. Um, and then that will pretty much be my damage build. Um, after, of course, I finish off, like, a, um, a Mob Malmortius. Might as well if I got the Hex Shrinker already. But, um, that'll pretty much be all the damage that I'm gonna want. Oh, God. And there it is. 25 stacks. Oh, God, he's full. How the hell are we gonna fight that now? Um... Oh, God, no! Okay, well, we got the... Z well, we haven't got the Zack yet. Oh, the cast is gonna die! Get these things, get these things, get these things, get these things. The blobs, the blobs, the blobs, the blobs, the blobs, the blobs! Blobs! Guys, what are you doing? He's, guys, hit him! Jesus Christ! <laughs> what are we? Everybody's just watching the blobs as they just respawn. I can't believe, like, he didn't jump away. He could have gotten away from that easily. He respawned, and then he just sat there attacking the turret. I think he just assumed that he was dead. But he ended up living! <laughs> I don't know what just happened there. <laughs> okay, so... Uh, I think I'm gonna keep my Corruptor Potion for right now. Um, we don't have a dragon yet, so this could be our first dragon of the game. But Zack is... Okay, no, Zack's dead. He's just gonna ult you. Yeah, there it goes. Okay, but we got a kill. Is that worth a dragon for a kill? Probably. Yeah, I would take that. It is only their second dragon of the game, which is why I think it was uh, more worth it for us. Uh, don't get me wrong. You don't want to give up things like that, but I think on the grand scale of things, that wasn't the, the worst trade to get a kill onto that Blitzcrank. Because it's actually, I think, definitely worth it because killing that Blitzcrank resets some of his stacks. So now he's only at 15, which is a pretty big deal going from like the 25 down to 15. That's... That's a huge loss for the Blitzcrank. Okay, so it looks like Quinn maybe gone a little bit too deep. Ends up dying to the Cassiopeia. Um, I'm just going to kind of use this time to jungle to get my CS up. I'm at 164. Cassiopeia is beating me in farm. For now! Ha ha ha! Suck it, Cass. Okay. I see a wild misfortune who isn't very fond of her life right now. Oh, God, I love it. I didn't actually even E to her. I E'd to a minion. Luckily, it didn't matter because I have so much damn damage that we still ended up getting the kill. Okay. We saw the Kale run down. I really want this. Do they have this warded? They might have this warded. I don't know. I'm kind of panicking. Should I stay? Should I go? Man, if Blitzcrank hooks, though. Oh god, oh god, I'm sorry, Rumble! No, the Ignite's not gonna be enough. Oh god, oh god, oh god, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry! <laughs> Crap, I really probably could have saved the Rumble. Um, I don't know what is warded around here. All I know is that Blitzcrank is scary, and if he gets a hook on me, I'm probably dead. Okay. Are you guys going to go in on this? Somebody going to go in on this? Is anything going to happen? Come on, guys. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Okay. We made it. It's all good in the hood. Oh, I don't want to be. Fuck that. I want to help. And I did. Okay. I'm, I'm going B now, though. Oh, 
Oh god, this just does not seem smart. I might be able to do some cleanup here if nobody knows that I'm here. Um... I, d I don't know what to do. I'm gonna try to run away. <laughs> I'm just so scared. Okay, we could turn on this. No! <laughs> okay, your turn then. Damn, I really wanted to steal that kill onto the misfortune. <laughs> it's kind of unfortunate, but hey, oh well. Uh, you know what? It was a dick move if I were to take that, so uh, I will I will concede it to the Rumble, who's now at seven kills. So after having a fairly rough start against that Blitzcrank, definitely made his way back. Also 175 CS, so we're feeling pretty good about this game, but it is definitely a close game. I'm going to pick up... Oh, never mind. I don't have any spaces available. Um, yeah, so 11-5 and 9, 35-31. to 31. Really, really tight game. But as we saw, if I jump onto the Miss Fortune, or to be honest, I could probably jump onto the Cassiopeia as well. Um, because she hasn't finished Azonia's yet. Once she finishes Azonia's, I'm going to be in a little bit of trouble. Um, it's going to be a lot harder for me to kill her. Oh, hello. Come on. Come to Papa. Come here. Come here. Just... Sit back and take it. There's, there's no escaping this. I can assure you that you are going to die. We found her. I didn't even need to ulti there, but why not? It's on like a 30 second cooldown, right? Okay. So, oh god, they are pushing mid. They are pushing mid hard. So Rumble's going to TP. He does have his equalizer available, so he could probably just ulti the wave if it was really at risk of dying. But looks like we're going to be okay. I'm just going to rush back up here. Oh, God, they're starting a fight. Oh, Blitzcrank is going to die. Or is he? Nice flash. Okay, I'm coming to assist. Oh, our Blitzcrank did die. Okay, so what do we do here? Oh, he died to the Blitzcrank. Blitzcrank killed Blitzcrank. Oh, God, please don't do it. Oh, avoided. We could... Oh, could we fight this? No, we probably couldn't. We probably shouldn't, at least. Like, maybe we could. But I don't think we want to. Um, I wonder if they have any wards kind of around this area. Because it looks like... Oh, God. No, the Kale! Oh, God, I'm so fucked, aren't I? No! No! Oh, the Kale ulti! I didn't kill Miss Fortune quick enough. And she just, she has no mana! <laughs> just barely not enough time. Maybe I could have killed her quicker. You guys could probably turn on this. Just, yeah, just fight. Fight. Oh, God! This Blitzcrank damage is insane! Oh, my God! Okay, Zack does have his passive. Um, he has passive. I'm just trying to make people- Oh my god, he's gonna kill you! Yeah, you gotta run! You might be dead! Oh man, this is brutal. Drag up. We should go for it. Because we don't have a single dragon yet, so that's gonna be pretty important. Um, I feel- For some reason, I feel like I'm actually lacking damage. I can't believe I couldn't destroy that MF quicker. But I couldn't. But we can at least go for the mob now, Morty, so that'll be good. Um, that'll be my last damage item, and then we gotta build something a little bit more defensive. I'm thinking, to be honest, like a Banshee's Veil. Um, normally I wouldn't go something like that, but to be honest, we have to try to avoid things like the Blitzcrank Hook, which are the things that are killing us right now. Oh, that got interrupted. I'm a-coming. Okay. Oh, there we go. Blobs ahoy! There we go. We killed them this time. Okay. So I managed to actually, I think I avoided the uh, the Cassiopeia ultimate again um, by using my E. Which I gotta say was pretty damn fancy. Okay, there's a big mini wave in the bot lane, which I really want. So I'm gonna go and take it. I'm gonna take it. No, Quinn, you're so fast! Don't you dare. Okay, good. <laughs> my minions. 
Okay, so there we go. Big mini wave for me. 1,000 gold. Do I have enough to finish off my maw? I do. So let's go pick off my maw of Malmortis, and then I would go for the Banshee's Veil, because I'll be able to block things like the Blitzcrank Hook, which are going to be the things that end up killing me. Um, I might as well right now pick up another pink, uh, just because we have space in our inventory, and we're not buying anything else. Um, so hopefully we can block something like the Blitzcrank Hook, the Silence from his ultimate, um, the Cassiopeia ultimate, something like that. Like, hopefully the Banshee's Veil will allow us to maneuver more and do something more. Okay, so we got our 40% CDR as well with the blue buff, which is exactly what we were looking for. That's, we are, we are feeling good about that. They don't seem to have anything warded around here though. So I guess I'm just going to take this scootle. Eh. Eh. Oh god, looks like people are dying! I might be able to make it. Ha ha! Suckers! Oh god! <laughs> ah! <laughs> it was just flail! Flail! Use any ability that you have left! Okay, so it looks like my team got caught out a little bit there. I'm not entirely sure what happened, but um, that was not a good trade for us. It was a three for two, but a lot of pressure onto our top lane turret, which is definitely not good. Um, also a lot of pressure now on our mid lane. Zack is good. What are you? Why? Why? Why would you do that? Don't get hooked. Please don't get hooked. I guess he took a lot of turret damage. Oh, the Blitzcrank coming in. No, there's the ultimate and oh my god. Wow. That, that Blitzcrank damage is something else. Ho. Oh. Okay. So, <laughs> I don't, I don't really know how to deal with that. Um, jeez. Yeah, 25 stacks again. I wonder what AP he's at right now. Because that just, like, he blew up the Urgot. Like, that wasn't even close. And the problem is, now that he's got a, um, a tier of the Goddess as well, he's going to start sacking that, so his Mana Shield is going to be even more brutal. Plus, he's got the Death Cap. Like, man, he's going to be doing an insane amount of damage. Okay, I'm not entirely sure what to do here. Um, we could probably just push this thing up initially. Um, we need to try to get like a Baron or something like that. Okay, I don't think we could actually kill anybody there if we tried. I did see the misfortune. Oh god. Oh god, she knows I'm here. Huh. Damn it! Oh, the Ignite's not even enough! That sucks. Oh god, and we also lost Quinn up in the top lane. But that was so that was a two for I guess two overall. Oh god, no, 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 not me, I'm too beautiful. Okay, we're alive. If I get hooked though, I'm fucked. Okay, the hook's down. Everybody in! I don't I don't really want to be here, to be honest. They do so much damage. They do so much damage. Oh god, here it comes. Yep. Oh my god. Yeah, we just we have to avoid getting ho Oh, that's actually a <laughs> Nice! The trade-off of the Blitz Ultimates! Okay. I've got a decent amount of health. I still have my Ghost Blade, so we do have a lot of turret pushing potential. Cassiopeia is not up for a little bit. Blitzcrank is probably not gonna be here because he doesn't really have his combo left. So we might be able to. Oh god, I tried to do as much damage as possible, but it's not going to be anywhere near enough to deal with that. I ended up getting silenced, and I just couldn't really do much after that one. And I had nothing to escape to with my E, so I just kind of had to engage with it. Oh, he doesn't have his ultimate yet. Oh no, he's dead, he's dead! No! Run, Blitz! Not enough. Okay, what the hell do we need to do to actually win this game? Um... They're just getting so tanky and have so much damage with that damn Blitzcrank. But the problem is if our Urgot keeps getting hooked, like, we're never going to win. But who can get hooked? Like, nobody's actually tanky enough to get hooked by that guy other than, like, the Rumble. 
Oh man, just Urgot being out of position here. Yeah, he's gonna die. There we go, again. Not a big fan of this Urgot pickup. <laughs> okay, um, well, we'll have our Banshee's Veil fairly soon, but I don't really think it's gonna be enough. Okay, Cassiopeia is staying. If I get my home guards up, can we reach her? Well, we could get close. No, she's definitely not stupid enough to stick around here, right? No way. Okay, I'm going to check the blue buff because it's... Well, they're probably... They might actually very well be at it. Did we also lose a dragon? No, we didn't. Okay, dragon's going to be up in 12 seconds, so we could try to do that. Dragone? Anyone? Oh my god! No! Well, we grabbed the cast. Come on, do enough damage. Perfect. A nice fight in the equalizer. Fight in the equalizer. You guys got this. Come on. Yes, Zach being slowed. Perfect. Blitzcrank killed our Blitzcrank though, but come on, Rumble with the chase. Is it going to be enough? Is it going to... No! 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 Under 100 HP. Okay. Well, we got the Zack at least, but man, Blitzcrank is just running around picking off people left, right, and center. And now the support, Kale, is pushing our base. We just don't have enough to deal with it. The only way that that was actually going to pan out for us is if we won that fight. Part. Man, this Blitzcrank is a god. SG Winky 1795. Holy crap. I didn't think that a top lane AP Blitzcrank was going to work, but man, is he showing me otherwise. Oh, I just barely don't have enough to get my Banshee's Veil. That would have been helpful to get, but... So, yeah, and now there's Support Kale, who's not even really Support. More like Top Lane Kale. Um, just got to Split Push our base, got a second Inhibitor, and now we're gonna lose a Nexus turret, and there's nothing I can do about it. I don't even know if I can save the second turret. Come on. Okay, at least we can save that. That's something. Well, so now we're in Turtle Mode. Hmm... Okay, so what the hell do we do? We have enough now to get our Banshee's Veil, so we're basically full build unless... Well, we just have to get our upgrade to our boots. But, um... There's nothing we can really do. Like, this Kale is doing more work than half their team! Okay. Oh, Blitzcrank is dead. Just keep on getting hooked. Okay, so there's the Kale ultimate. At least that's gone. So we know that that's not going to be an option for them. That means that we could be aggressive. I don't want to be too aggressive, though, because if I be too aggressive, then I die. And that's not fun for me. Okay, we found the Zack. Come on, do you want to you wanna fight? You want to go? You know who I am? I'm a Latalan. Okay, I could definitely burst out this misfortune. That's my goal here. Like, my goal is to jump on MF and kill her very very quickly because if we can do that then at least it's a 4v5 okay they have a ward there which we can sweep out that shouldn't be an issue blitzcrank is right there not seeing any wards okay this is where magic needs to happen looks like we're not being able we're not gonna be able to make magic happen at all crap they actually got away just so damn quickly we haven't been able to do anything! Even the times that we see that we might have a ability to do something. I never come. Oh god. Oh god. Why do I feel like this just does not look good? Okay. Oh god. Ah! Got him! Got him, coach! I'm helping the team! Oh god, but Zack is in our base! He's not gonna actually win it! Oh, is he? No, okay, he didn't. Oh my god. Oh. Why does this game have two AP Blitzcracks? I know! I have no idea why! Is this the new thing? Did I miss some patch notes? I don't think I did. God, it takes a while to get this thing down when you have no mana. So we're seeing, though, like, my damage is there. Like, we can definitely get kills. But we're losing absolutely everything in our base. Yep, there's the inhibitor. There's our third inhib. Okay, I'm gonna want that. 
Um, and that's pretty much it. And let's get an upgrade and hopefully, okay, our inhibitor's back up. So there's only going to be probably one wave of two super minions. Um, so hopefully we'll be able to deal with that. I, I think we'll be okay dealing with it initially. Um, just that first kind of round of super minions. But the thing is, we have no nexus turrets left. So they could easily, and man, our, our nexus is not healthy either. So if they just decide to five man rush into our base, I can't guarantee that we're actually going to be able to clean that up. We also just can't move too far away because in the time that it takes for us to be, we could lose an inhibitor and then possibly our base. Okay, so our Blitzcrank cleaned up a Kale. That's pretty good. But then the Blitzcrank cleared up our Blitzcrank. But we did get our first Dragon of the game. Okay. So blue buff has been picked up by me. Not a bad thing. Um, probably going to want to go B, aren't I? Man, there's just nothing that we can really do here. Not with all these super minions pouring in. Um, they could very well go for the... They're probably going to go for the Baron. There's not really a whole lot that we can do to stop them. We just kind of have to keep our base alive. Okay, so there's the end of the uh, double super minion wave. So that's a good thing. But now that I've got a little bit of mana, we could actually deal damage to these things. And hopefully take them down fairly quickly. Okay, those things are dead. Gonna go back to base because they have a large mini wave coming in the mid side. They're not going for the Baron. That's a piece of good news for us. I got my home guards. I got blue buff. And I have a misfortune in my sights. Okay. Doesn't look like... Man, this is so nerve-wracking. I hate it when games are this... I love it and I hate it at the same time when games are this close. Okay, that is unfortunate. She finally landed an LT on me. Oh god. Rumble's taking a shit ton of damage here. Oh man, Urgot just walked right in. Oh, there we go. Okay. But Kale's still alive. No, we're gonna lose the game. I can't get there. I gotta try. Let's try to kill this Kale. I don't know. No! No! Damn it! So we did end up losing the game. I tried everything in my power to carry that game as talent. We did have a really good game, but sadly just the differences in teams and the Blitzcrank's lane swapping and landing some really clutch hooks. I gotta give him credit. He definitely carried this game for his team, but hopefully you guys did enjoy that talent game. You can't win them all, but it was definitely fun. So show that like button a little bit of love if you did enjoy the game. Definitely if you want to follow me on Twitter, my Twitter handle is at TwiggerLol. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you enjoyed content like this and want to see more. And ladies and gentlemen, as I always say, see you guys in the next video.